they, yeah, the whole thing, the, the fact that, so what would you, uh, put this into a, into a proper, uh, thing. All right. Say you're like in your, in your, uh, tens and ten years old, right? Yeah. Before you're hitting your teens. How would you solve a government crisis? Those card games. This is this is a straight up her sister was a witch, right? What makes her sister a princess? The look at Witch in the East, bro, moment. <laughs> you know what? It sounds so like you're right. Oh, it sounds bullshit when you say it out loud. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> Emma, was I wrong? <laughs> You know what's funny is I ha I a whole hundred percent would have expected to hear that out of a fucking little Karibo Yu-Gi-Oh bridge episode. Just hearing that here is just like, oh god. <laughs> oh god, he's right. <laughs> it, 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 oh yeah, it's all coming together. Oh my god. <laughs> I'm totally pulling souls inside my soundboard! <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> That's it's it's it, it, it's how we as kids would want to solve our problems though. Yeah. Um, with the whole thing with the bullying and all that. We just want just play split we just wanna play cards together, man. We just wanna don't wanna do not that. <laughs> uh it didn't even have to be Yu-Gi-Oh at the time. It could have been anything. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Uh, I want to call it famous at this point because I think everyone has fucking either even, even if they haven't seen you everyone has seen it the Kaiba versus Pharaoh fights like just we all know it. draw your last pathetic card Yugi my deck has no pathetic cards Kaiba <laughs> fucking unleash this exodia the forbidden one I believe that's what we call the ass pull yeah <laughs> I think we can 100% agree e for the fact that bef that along in the tournament, literally Yugi Yugi had to be crippled in that aspect by no longer having Exodia the Forbidden One as his ace in the sleeve. I think we can agree that's like it it's a power fantasy. In every sense of the word. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if we want, like, okay, oh my god, I fucking, you're talking about the children's card. You know what, fucking, even as a child, you know what cracked me up? Is the fucking, like, w later on in the series, Yugi and Kaiba have a fight. And at some point, Kaiba just goes, yeah, if you attack, if you attack me, and if you attack me, that attack will hit me. But I'm gonna be standing over this ledge, and you're gonna kill me. Okay. <laughs> I'm like, dude! You know, you know, I will give him this. Man did have his brother, or soul stolen by Pegasus, so I can see why he would be dead that desperate. But. I, I will give him that. <laughs> <laughs> that even do, again, when you really think about how bullshit is these are these plots, yeah, I I still I have the ability to steal your brother's soul. If you want it back, you have to fight me in a children's card game. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> I never thought about it. Oh until my god! Really put it into words. It's like I get it. In hindsight, I get why he was desperate. Yeah. <laughs> oh my fucking god! I, I, yeah. I, I, 
behind just the scenes. Cut to, just cut to just. I'm gonna clip this. Cut to that scene from Trolls. Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! Yeah, yeah. This it, it's 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 no contest. S tier. S tier. S tier. Yeah, she put it in C tier. But now that we're talking about it, and now we realize how fucking insane this must sound out of context or even in context yeah there's there's no other place it can go i really grew up in the raw generation this shit sounds stupid it was and we loved it every second of it every single second of it <laughs> yu yo original loved it even if it is fucking stupid gx Okay, I, I'm going to admit, Get Your Game On is a fucking memorable bop. I, I will admit that. It is. 5Ds? Actually, not that bad. I liked it. it okay, it, it still has the whole, like, stupid children's car game thing, but it does have some pretty interesting ideas, like characters, like, like the main character growing up in, like, poverty, and, like, this just, I, I don't know what you want to call it, like, Akira-esque type city. Yeah, Akira, it, it definitely felt Akira-esque. Yeah, like, it's... Like, I don't know, it's like, 5Ds was, uh... 5Ds was really good. I don't know. After that, I just kind of fell off of Yu-Gi-Oh, though.